Hello everybody again, this is Kingfish UK here. A quick look up at the map at the um, return to Chernobyl, uh, the afternoon game. Uh, the team leader wanted us to capture the school first because that was where most of the fighting was in the morning. So just a quick look at where I was at the first half of the... Ah. So yeah, I was a bit knackered after the uh, morning game. Getting, getting a bit tight after having an hour for lunch. Took a bit of time to get loosened up again. The muscles were uh, aching like hell. So yeah, we're we're into the school. Got here before the blues because this is where we were in the morning, and the blues were trying to get into here. So we decided to try and get up here as fast as possible. You can push back on the left hand side as far as possible. Yeah, so just walk into here. I start, start taking some incoming and I'm thinking, who the hell's firing at me? All <laughs> alone, blue. All on his top. You out? Nice, I thought you were friendly. <laughs> <laughs> I do apologise for the coughing. Of, I am full of cold. Uh, uh, I was full of cold at this event, should I say. He's gone, he's gone. Yeah, so just off to my left. You red, just can't red, see he's, uh, he's not there anymore. Three, four reds. I've taken him out. On the left hand side. Yeah, this window just gives me a really good beat on the far left hand side without showing myself too much. Really good cover. Now building on the left out of bounds where Hedgehog is. So. Push a little bit further into this room so you can get a visual look. So the blues are in the building just off to the right. There's quite a lot of cover just in front of there as well. Little boxes and low lying branches from the trees, so it was quite difficult to get through to them. Right, they're gonna position themselves over yeah. this side. The bank. Tom! Tom! They're going to they're going for the bank! They're going for the bank! Yeah, so I, I basically defend so like this door and the left hand side in the uh, toilet area just spot a couple of blues walking up get too much out in the open I do get one I'll get the front one and you can see the problem with the low lying branches one of the paint one of the balls are already uh, been sliced by the branches Yeah, I get the first one, he starts walking back. Second one's still there. Tom, watch the windows on your back! Wanting <coughs> to do a couple of runs from building to building, and um, once uh, once the opposition t right. opposition team had got set in the building, you could do it, but you'd have quite a lot of luck to get there. Yeah, so as you can see, there's. Just off to the right, that's there, but the blues are in that building there. Um, there's quite a lot of barricades just outside that building, so they can move up on this left hand side we, from cover to cover pretty easily. Just hear a little bit of movement coming from behind. I'm leaving myself exposed from the door because there's still nobody defending the door. So I'm trying to do two jobs at once. Uh, it was a damn good day. Weather was uh, perfect for paintballing. Nice sunny day. Very little wind. Got the wind picked up a little bit in the afternoon. Nothing drastic though. Uh, great day. Yeah, 
Yeah, so just in that sunlight there, there's a couple of reds just laid down behind a stack of bricks. There's a big mound of bricks just on the floor. So I just check the front door again. That's see how most activity that I do get is um, probably this left hand side here just through this door, through this window. Just spot one, get him to run back into cover. He decides to run back. So the branches were a bit of a pain. They were quite low, so I couldn't really act, act my painting as I normally do. It was about 50% of the paint that was sliced up by the branches. So you're pretty lucky to get get one out at that sort of angle. I keep them pinned quite well. Make them think about the window. See one bottom of the can on the screen. We're gonna put a couple of rounds in around that paint. Yeah. Cover's pretty thick on the uh, left hand side for the blues. Pretty easy to get from barricade to barricade. Back Red. and check the door. Hey. Red. 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 Yeah, I'm keeping an eye on the left as well because it's busy down here. Oh, yeah. So I'm doing this and that. Good. I'm, I'm in here. Though. Right, okay. Right. You still can't see any movement out the front. So they keep on trying to push up on this left hand side. You can see all the branches on top of the screen. Got a couple of rounds on him, well, you not too. Long, really, about half a metre away. Just can't get the paint through where I want it to. Move it left. I'm ninety percent sure I got that lad. Only ninety though. Just that walking back. And somebody knows where I am now. A lot of paint coming in. He's on the mound of mound of shit. What oh, is the one in there? See if this lad needs a hand. He waves me off. You alright? Yeah, yeah, I've got it. Make him fall. Sorry, Paul. I do have a show. Shout him. Um, He's shooting slightly. Didn't realise I got him first time. Didn't realise I hit you first time. Round. I didn't realise I hit you first time. Bonga. Yeah. Um, you get some nice DMR shots in here. I do spend another uh, five or six minutes um, in this Fruit building. Fruit building. Doing exactly what I've been doing. So I edited the video down slightly. Ground, ground floor. Um, so if you, if you just look through, the, through, just to the right through that, look through that angle through there, that you there. get some ground floor through um, there. The blues are pushed up in front of this building. It was a bit of a blind spot because there's no wind in the well. front of the building.
some nice cover behind this big tree just to keep out of the building that was in. Just a little bit of movement off to my right to see what's going on the corner of the building. There is one behind the fallen tree as well, just on the right hand side there. I'm just trying to sneak down this right hand side without being spotted. The blues. I'm just giving them something to think about now. trying to get let out by the behind the tree. Just taking out before he gets there. I do see the lad behind the uh, fallen trees. It's just a point of shooting at him. They won't make it through. He sticks his head out again put a bit more rounds on him. I thought six eight was firing a bit low. I uh, didn't, didn't know why, but I cleaned it out and there was a small blockage in one of the uh, air chambers. So I got, I got that problem sorted. So I was a little bit handicapped on the day, but the was fairly accurate. Spot the uh, spot the distance. Don't don't think you realised how open he was. Got him on the head. Just trying to see if I can spot a red to tell him what's going on inside the building. On the corner of the building, and on one on the tree, the fallen tree. Mm. Quick change. Tree as well, tree as well. Yeah, this lad does a... Uh suicide mission. He does make it to the fallen tree. I think he does take the lad out behind it as well. And he gets a quarter of the way back and he just gets taken out. I do spot another one just coming past where I shot that previous lad out from before. Waiting for him to get just past them, just past this big tree. And the ref just gets in the way of where I want to shoot him first. My paint just splits either side of him. That's coming up to the end of this video. Hope you enjoyed it. Yeah, I get going gets taken out with a first strike. I think it was Paul that was by, by the side of the fallen tree on the right hand side. If you like this video, press like. If you want to subscribe, subscribe. Hopefully I'll have another one out next week. Nice, hit the gun! Later.